We're the only raid in the Navy with safety in its name. We save lives. We're responsible for the safety of the air crew and the aircraft, whether it be a fire in the engine, or ice forming on the wings, or a loss of pressurization in the aircraft. The ejection seat gives you a chance to get out the aircraft if it goes down. We have two initiators, an RC rocket motor that will put out 4,800 pounds of thrust in 0.25 seconds, launching about 300 feet in the air. It's a complex system. You don't have a redundant. The ejection seat has to work 100% of the time. If the pilot or air crew decides to bail out from the aircraft, I have an opportunity to save his life by being a technician on that eject seat. It's an honoring thing. If the aircraft loses pressurization, obviously if you're above 10,000 feet, you can't really breathe normally. There's a fire bottle inside the nacelle that shoots fire retardant inside the engine and allows the air crew to pretty much use one engine to land. It's very likely to get ice that forms up on the wings of the aircraft, which weighs them down. The bee ice crew inflates, and it breaks up those ice crystals across the wing. You know, the birds will come back broken. You have to essentially stay up all night and fix the, fix the bird to get ready for the flight schedule the next day. When you have to bend and contort your, your body in so many different directions to reach that thing. They made it hard to get to some of these items that we need to replace. <laughs> Definitely adrenaline and a lot of stress. A lot of stress. You just make the best of it. I've never been a mechanic before in my life. To work on something as cool as an airplane for the Navy is outstanding work. <laughs>